After taking to the streets, Wes Seaman finds kidney for wife. CBS News. CBS News.com Vertical Line CBS Evening News Vertical Line CBS This Morning Vertical Line 48 Hours Vertical Line 60 Minutes Vertical Line Sunday Morning Vertical Line Face the Nation Vertical Line Up to the Minute Log in Vertical Line Register Your Profile Vertical Line Log Out CBS Evening News Full Episodes Interviews Washington Business Health on the Road About Us The Team September 13, 2013, 7.43 p.m. Print text. After taking to the streets, Wes Seaman finds kidney for wife. By Steve Hartman. Play CBS News video. Scroll left, scroll right. Play 9 over 13. Colorado towns cut off by floods. Man finds. 9 over 13. Colorado towns cut off by floods. Man finds life-saving kidney for his wife. Play 9 over 12. Colo. Towns drenched by flooding rains. Voyager 1. 9 over 12. Colo. Towns drenched by flooding rains. Voyager 1 exceeded lead scientists' expectations. Play S.C. Man's search for kidney for his wife. S.C. Man's search for kidney for his wife has happy ending. Play on the road. S.C. Man finds life-saving kidney for. On the road. S.C. Man finds life-saving kidney for his wife. Play Colorado Towns Cut Off I Record Floods. Colorado Towns Cut Off I Record Floods. Play Colo. Towns Drenched as Mountainsides Scorched by Wildfires Can't. Colo. Towns Drenched as Mountainsides Scorched by Wildfires Can't Stop Rain. Play California. Passes Bill Allowing Illegal Immigrants to Get Drivers. California. Passes Bill Allowing Illegal Immigrants to Get Drivers Licenses. Play World's Largest Solar Plant Set to Power California. Homes. World's Largest Solar Plant Set to Power California. Homes. Play Nervous Bear Walks the Streets of Gatlinburg. 10. Nervous Bear Walks the Streets of Gatlinburg. 10. Play Voyager 1 Exceeded Lead Scientists' Expectations. Voyager 1 Exceeded Lead Scientists' Expectations. Play Graphic Video. Rebels Execute Syrian Soldiers. Graphic Video. Rebels execute Syrian soldiers. Play U.S. Russia talks on Syria at pivotal moment. U.S. Russia talks on Syria at pivotal moment. CBS News Charleston, S.C. One way or another, it had to end like this. One way or another, Larry Swilling knew his wife Jimmy Sue would eventually be hospitalized with a failing kidney. He knew he'd have tears, only thing he didn't know was whether they'd be happy or sad. Larry Swilling asked complete strangers to donate one of their kidneys in order to save his wife. When we first met Larry a year ago, he was desperately trying to rewrite his wife's final chapter. Since she needed a kidney, and he had no shame on the matter, Larry set out to find an organ donor on his own. Never mind that most people won't give panhandlers their pocket change, let alone their vital organs. Larry, at the age of 77, started walking all over his hometown of Anderson. South Carolina, basically begging for a kidney. I had to do something, he said. She looks after me, and I look after her. Larry Swilling and his wife Jimmy Sue. Flash CBS. After 57 years of marriage, their love is so palpable, it practically melts you in your seat. Which is probably why, after our first story aired, thousands of people called to offer their kidneys. There's a mighty bunch of good people out there, just wanting to help. Larry said. More than 100 of that mighty bunch went through the testing to see if they were a match, and would you believe, one was. After a full year of searching, this week, Larry Swilling finally met his miracle. She's a 41-year-old retired Navy lieutenant commander named Carly Weaverling. Carly Weaverling flash CBS News. Have you ever just had a feeling that was just a strong gut feeling that you just went with your instinct, because you just knew it was right? Carly asked. That's exactly what happened. I could do something to give this family hope. The surgery was Wednesday morning, and by Wednesday afternoon, Larry was accosting doctors, giving them all their hugs. Everything went perfectly. Now Larry says he is to new missions, to find other donors for other people, and to find a way to properly thank the woman who gave him his wife back. After a full year of searching, Larry Swilling finally met his miracle this week. Flash CBS News. There's not enough words, he said, struggling to find a way to thank Kelly. Just take care of your 